welcome back to our channel everybody today we are going to finish off sienna's bedroom well not finish it off but obviously crack on with it um the walls are in quite bad state so we've decided to put lining paper over them and obviously then paint which makes it gives it a nicer finish and obviously we're going to go and do that now dinner's prepared we've got a nice roast chicken for dinner and obviously kdj is on the floor down there sulking i'll show you there she is down there <laughs> and there's lee over there Hi guys. and there's madison over there so yeah we're just gonna go up there and obviously hopefully she's moved her bed and everything so we can crack up with the wallpaper in and hopefully we'll do a kind of time lapse of her room so Lee's just going upstairs on his stair lift, obviously, and extremely on his extremely <laughs> sl slow stair lift. And there's Katie J Monopoly. And, and Mum asked me if I wanted to watch TV, but I chose a board game. Yeah, if anyone that knows KDJ, anyone that knows KDJ, she never chooses a board game over YouTube. Something's wrong, she must be coming down with something. So, yeah, we're just literally going up now. Um, I'm going to inspect the kids' rooms because obviously they said they've tidied them. Obviously, Sienna's exempt from this inspection at the moment. At the moment. But once her room's done, she won't be exempt. So, I'm just going into Madison's room. Not bad. Yeah. Madison's room. Because I'm always in my room now. <laughs> Madison's room's quite, um, quite tidy for Madison. So she's got all her perfumes and that up there, and a little uh, Disney bag up there. And Xbox and, and then charge. she's got. An Xbox controller on charge. I don't know why. I don't know. It's in the spoon. And she's got her teddies and her bed. And yeah. For anyone that's wondering, obviously, why Madison's in this room. Madison's in this room because Jade no longer lives with us. No. Um, we will do another video on that another time, explaining what happened. But Madison now has her own room. Sienna has the other room. Because Bethany's also moved out and gone to university. Mm. Kenzie's always had his own room. Kenzie's always, yeah. always had his own room. Oh. Um, so has KDJ. Me and Madison's always shared a room, like all yeah. our life. So, so you're looking forward to having your own room, aren't it's you? It's weird as so. well. Waking up and just being like, you're in the room. So yeah, we're just going to go into Sienna's room now. Oh my. As you can see, we've put flooring down. It's a bit messy because obviously we're doing work. Um, we put the flooring down in the landing and obviously once it's done we will kind of give you a full tour and we've also pulled the stair carpet up we're, we're going to paint the stairs actually we need to do a inspection of Mackenzie's room you can't really so see so ready cause... everybody this is Mackenzie's room actually quite tidy so he's got I'll come back a little bit he's got a gaming hive sleeper that we bought him as you know and he's got his tv under there 40 inch tv lucky little lucky little sod and then he's got his game rocker that he plugs his headphones into and all his um xbox controller charger i didn't want sense and everything over there and then obviously he's got his teddies over there. No, they're Sen's ones. He's pulled his blind right up, but obviously... Mm. That's more light. It's actually it's actually quite nice. And he's got his windows open. Yeah. So, yeah. Can't really he's quite lucky, isn't window. he? So, yeah. So, Kenzie's room's tidy. So, well done, Ken. So you can go on your Xbox now. <laughs> so, that's what he's waiting for. He's waiting for me to inspect his room so he can go on his Xbox. So, you're going to go on your Xbox and sit on your rocker. Huh? Yeah. So he's down there plugging his all his Xbox in. What are you doing? The power lead was in the right way. Look how quick he plugs his Xbox in. 
You need to get dressed. No. So, I can't yeah. Hear anything over That's it. Right, there you go. He's putting his headphones in. Right, so this is Sienna's room so far. As you can see, it's quite a big room. So she's quite lucky. She got the better half of the deal, didn't she? Mm. Um, but I trust her to keep it tidy and modern. I do listen. Oh, um, so we've gone for... Get out of the way. Pink. We've gone for pink, diamond. was it pink chandelier? Yeah, diamond. Diamond wallpaper. And this was from? Home base. Home base. And £20 a roll. Well, can't you? Because it's like yes, a fabric. Yes, £20 someone's, a roll. Someone's got expensive bloody taste. Someone's got expensive taste and bloody spoil. Yeah, but it's like a fabric type wallpaper, so that's why it's more expensive. But Because see, regardless is, of what you hear elsewhere, See, this is the difference. None of these kids actually want for nothing. Um, so if you do hear... So anything you hear from outside of these four walls obviously is absolute rubbish because obviously these kids get everything. Even like 20 pound wallpaper. <laughs> Even if and we have to make ourselves pretty much bankrupt, they will get. Eight, how much if we can afford it, they will get it. How much is my, was my bed? And a 100 pound bed come in on Tuesday, haven't you? Yeah. So yeah, if you hear otherwise, please don't believe it. It's absolute rubbish, absolute nonsense. Um, all the kids, even Bethany, even though she's left home, all sport rotten and want for nothing. They've got iPads, they've got laptops, they've got GoPros. So should we go to Florida next year? And as well? yeah, we're going to America next year. Which cost? Lots of money, that's all you <laughs> need to know. Yeah. So, yeah. That's her wall so far. They're the colours of the wall, but they're going to be um, obviously uh, lining paper. And that's her pit stitch picture. I've got the legal. Who, who drew that for you, Beth? Beth. Um, Bethany drew this picture for Sienna. Sienna's going through a mad Lilo and Stitch phase at the moment. So. I've even got pajamas. I'm doing a favour, Sam. Yeah. Can you run downstairs, unplug everything out of the extension but, room, and bring it up here for me? As you can see, these walls are in quite bad condition. We've had to fill them and like. Um, Got to sand it down and then we're going to put lining paper on it, like we have here. I don't know if you can see. And yeah, the, the wall for Sienna's outside Sienna's room, there was a big tree growing in the front garden. It had to be cut down, but they said they killed it by cutting the trunk. But they haven't, it's still grown and it's absolutely damaged the walls, hasn't it? Yeah. It's damaged the walls so bad. Oh, I can't show you, mate. We can't show you. If you, in a little while, once I've cut out, I will show you the damage it's done in the, what would be where the fit the... Vent. Yeah, where the air vent is. Um, I'll show you when we get to that part and then obviously you'll see the damage that it's actually done. Um, it's quite outstanding how much damage a little tree can do with because they put it too close to the house. Yeah, um, it's grown up and it's the, the roots for the tree have actually grown underneath the house. So it's basically cracked all the walls and the foundations of the house. So. to B&M to get some more of this which is going in Sienna's paint which is over there it's called Rose Haze from Home Base so it's, it'll add like a glimmery glittery shimmer kind of like to it. this kind of like what's on the wallpaper do you want to kind of get a closer so 
so like kind of like this when you but well, so you won't see it when you're like far away when you go like, close up to it you'll be able to see it it'll mainly be when the light yeah hits it. so yeah it took a little bit of convincing but i think she's kind of <laughs> on ball on on ball now isn't she on board on board now on board. On, on board now so she's not really doing much to help that's Sienna. Well, yeah, because I don't know what to do. I can't even do any painting because you need to go and get more of that. So, yeah, we need to go... I need to go get some more of this glitter. Um, so I've got to go get dressed and shoot over to B&M, which Look is on. about 20-minute drive from here. Shoot! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's what I should do when I do the no. video when you say shoot. <laughs> so I've got to go over to B&M. Excuse Lee's humour. Right, so I've just got in my car and I'm on my way to B&M to get some more, take my airpod out, um, to get some more glitter for Sienna's paint because we realise you need two packs for the size tin we've got. So I'm just going to go and get that and I will see you in a little while. I've just arrived at B&M and hopefully it's not too busy so I will catch you in a bit either when I'm in there or when I'm out I'll record in there if it's not too busy if not I'll see you when I get back to the car so I've just come out of B&M I got what I needed well I didn't get what I needed but I got something similar so I got this um, as you can see pink paint glitter it was a little bit more expensive but I had to get two of them so hopefully Sienna likes it if not it will go back and obviously be refunded but yeah that's what I did and then obviously just got some crisps down there so I'm just going to drive home now and hopefully things will obviously go smoothly for the rest of the day got to do dinner um, we've got roast chicken for dinner and I'm looking forward to that but I just hope it don't get too too much hotter. So we'll see you in a little while. So we are on our way home now, or well, I'm on my way home now. Obviously, Sienna and Lee and Madison, Kenzie and Katie are indoors. I need to open my window before I melt. And yeah, so we are just, I'm just on my way home not the glitter we wanted but hopefully it's very very similar it may even be a bit lighter i'm not sure um has anyone else used that glitter in their paint and how did it turn out have you got any pictures because it's something new that we're trying we're not sure if it's going to work or what it's going to look like sienna doesn't want it too glittery um but obviously we just want it to give a nice shimmer across the wall but not too in your face glitter so yeah if you know what it looks like or if you've used it on ceilings walls skirting boards then feel free to put pictures below if you can i'm not sure you can put pictures in the comments and let us know what it looks like
try and live life as normal as possible you've also still got to take precautions this virus is like still out there and we was doing well the infection rate was going down but it is good to see that the deaths are rising which is good um, when the deaths start rising that's what we need to worry at the moment
go back into a strict lockdown, you can forget your holidays, you can forget flying anywhere, you can forget going on a holiday. So just please, just just do the best you can. No one's saying you've got to follow the rules to a letter. Just take precautions, stay safe, and if you can't wear a mask, just kind of take extra precautions and just enjoy yourself, enjoy getting your life back to normal but the longer this goes on, the longer more people are selfish and don't follow the rules the longer this is going to carry on so yeah, just think before you kind of you know, go out to that party or go to a big concert or protest you know, we've all got things in life we don't agree with and unfortunately rules are rules but until they get silly, until the rules get silly, then there's no reason not to, fo to follow them um, and just kind of see how things go. Hopefully this new lockdown, not lockdown, this new rule of six coming in on Monday, hopefully will help the infection rate go back down again and hopefully that vaccine will kind of prove successful by Christmas or early part of next year and things can start getting back to normal. potatoes out off out the saucepan and put them into the roasting tin or roasting tray and we have done our special recipe potatoes the kids all love yeah. take a look at these chinese five spice potatoes if you haven't tried them definitely check it out because the kids love them chinese. you love them don't you yeah and we use this <coughs> swartz chinese five spice it's and obviously you like them don't you and you you're very fussy yeah and kdj likes them don't you i love them what we do is and it, ju it just gives a bit of flavor doesn't it what we do is we boil them and when we empty it out we just, just fluff the potatoes up so yeah go in and out in and out the colander and that just to give them and a bit of a fluff put, up and then we put them in there with oil in we and on. then we sprinkle some over and then we use a spoon to turn them and stuff like that and we sprinkle more where we have oil. Chinese rice spice, but yeah, my kids love it. Um, Lee loves it. So yeah, we're just gonna do the parsnips and I don't want the gammon. You don't want the parsnips. The gammon. So um, we're gonna do the kids gammon for dinner. You eat gammon at school. No, I I I mean parsnips. Oh, you don't like parsnips. Katie don't like parsnips. We're gonna do the parsnips now. Why do you not like parsnips? I don't know. Huh? School parsnips definitely taste much different. I don't know. They're it's probably like... always hard. Try my mace. I think you like them. They're nicer. <laughs> so yeah. So Sienna's now just going to put the oil in the round one. And I'm playing mine quite And just move it round. And then we are going to put the... Maybe you need a little bit more. No, it's fine. And then we're going to put the parsnips uh, in there. Use the... Prady keeps going. Ugh. Just and gonna we're just going to use these. Mix them around. And I'm not going to. I'm going to see if we've got some honey, but I'm not. Don't think we have. Is that recording? Yeah. So unfortunately, we haven't got no honey, so we're just going to have to do them plain today. But Can't we obviously, put a bit of spice? we could put a little bit of mix, mixed herbs on them, but you don't want too much. So yeah, we love our spices in this house, as you as you will see. So Sienna's just going to put. Do you know what? I'm actually going to sprinkle some on my hand. A little bit of mixed herbs on the parsnips, just to kind of give them a bit of flavour. Just put some on the top, and then I'm going to be able to mix them. Just, uh, just chuck it on. 
So yeah, so we're going to put some mixed herbs. mixed herbs or the parsnips to give it a bit of flavour. Then over here we've got the broccoli, cabbage and carrots cooking. Now I've actually switched it on <laughs> and obviously plugged it in, it might actually cook. Um, the gammon's in the fridge, potatoes are here, and the chicken is in the is oven, and I'm cooking, here. Is it this one and Katie Jay's here. So, the kids have got these for dinner, and uh, four gammon steaks. Morrison's have always got good deals on their um, fresh meat, like three for nine pounds. So, you, there's chicken, pork, gammon, meatballs, you like that, don't you? I love meat. Meatballs and stuff like that. So, yeah, they've got them for dinner, and they can have a bit of chicken as well if they want. So yeah so i'll catch up with you in a bit once it's nearly done so i've just tidied the kitchen and swept the floor and remember to put the potatoes in the oven because i come down and realized i hadn't put the potatoes in the oven so they weren't cooking and that's cooking nicely now turn it on <laughs> and it's leaking. and the camera's charging now obviously i put plugged it in and switched it on and then the chicken's all cooked yeah it's leaking uh oh, we've got a, we've got a spillage. Our steamer is mm. leaking. Everyone. Might need to get a new one. I might you probably put too much water in the furnace. So yeah, we're mm. just literally waiting for dinner. You know when you filled it and, up. And yeah. Did you empty the tray that was on the top with mm. the old water? No, was I supposed to? Well, yeah, because otherwise now you've got two lots of water. <sighs> oh okay. Silly me. Oh. Silly me. I'm trying to do remember like 20,000 things at once. Right, so oh. I made a boo boo. Oh well, never mind. You made a boo boo. Yes, you and made yes, a boo -boo. I got a boo boo there. You made a boo boo. And she's been a right sulky moo, moo bag today. That's why. Uh, I do. Nothing without the paint. So I've got to go out and get a new packet of wallpaper paste because we've got a mystery of the missing wallpaper paste. <laughs> we know it's here. We've it's seen ghost. it. And we think our ghost has taken it. What would the ghost want with wallpaper paste, actually? Well, maybe he wants to decorate his house. <laughs> what? He's imaginary house. He lives in this house. Maybe you want to. the ghost at a house. Maybe it's <laughs> an invisible house. You can't see it. Maybe it's an invisible house. Oh, I thought our ghost lives in this house. Yeah, no. but his invisible house is in this house. Oh, okay. So maybe maybe he won maybe his house is in the airing cupboard because it's nice and cozy in there. And he needs to do that. Okay then. And he wanted the wallpaper. Oh, okay. Comment below if your kids have got an imagination as well. <laughs> Six years old and thinks that we have got a ghost in this house. Our house is haunted. And one, but it's not. Not entirely sure he lives. In we're not sure. We're not entirely sure he lives in the airing cupboard. And and one, the ghost blames mum mum's phone off the arm. Yeah, he doesn't like my phone on the arm of the sofa. So yes, we have got a ghost in our house. <laughs> we have. We haven't had nothing bad happen, so we just kind of let it get on with it really. We've got quite a few sightings, like orbs on camera um, and stuff like that, in the hallway mainly, and the kitchen. But we just kind of like, we just kind of get on with it really. But so yeah, so I'm going down to get some more paper paste. Um, like, Cause like Katie said, the ghost has nicked it decorating his airy cupboard. <laughs> Otherwise we can't carry on. So I'll catch you in a bit. The kids' dinner's dished up. I'm just going to show you what they've got. Um, I haven't done a roast for a while, so it looks a bit boring compared to my normal roasts. But this is Kalia Jace because she's quite fussy. And then we got Sienna, Radisson's, and Kenzie's Where's dinner. That? Obviously, yours is here. And Kalia Jace looking forward to her dinner. Are you looking forward to your dinner? Yeah. Doing some gravy. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, we're just going to obviously... Um, well, you're going to have some. Yeah, I'm going to do my dinner. And I've got to cut chicken for me and Lee. But the kids have got gammon, so <laughs> they can do theirs quicker. So, Sienna's room's coming along nicely. 
as you can see. Obviously, I don't know what's going on with that bit. Um, so yeah, it's come along nicely. And just got to put the flooring down. Obviously, once it's all done, her bed's turning up on Tuesday. And I painted her windowsill. Hopefully, she hasn't touched it. That's looking a lot better. We sand it down. No, I haven't touched it. You actually. haven't touched it. Are you sure you haven't done it? No, I haven't. So, you happy with it so far? Yeah. So, as you can see, Sienna's busy at work. Busy, busy. Obviously, just pasting the paper. She's got to do her own room. We just supervise. Exactly. She's actually learned how to use a paste brush now, which is good. Instead of tiggling it. <laughs> Be quiet. Remember yesterday, she was tiggling it, wasn't she? Yeah. Some little madams get a bit big for her boots, don't you think? A bit silly when I've got such a big bucket of paste. Yeah. Head dunk. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> don't be copy then. Unless you want to suck at me. No, you just give you a shower. In paste. <laughs> <laughs> shower. Well, what? And I'm just dropping <laughs> For God's sake, Sienna. Just cannot get the staff. So, as you can see, obviously, all the papering is done. And all behind the door, all done. So, she's just sorting out her bed mattress on the floor for now. <laughs> Don't know what she's doing there. And, yeah, it's a bit messy, but obviously... Painting hopefully tomorrow or flooring tomorrow. I'm not sure what we're gonna do. Painting. We might do the flooring tomorrow. Give the walls time to dry. Damn. And dry. yeah. So yeah, we're done for today. So she can sort out the mess. Obviously, <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave the mess to her. I'm so boss, thank you for watching, guys. It's been a long day. Obviously, had a nice roast dinner. And obviously kids ate it all, apart from KDJ, but she never eats. So yeah, either painting tomorrow or flooring. I'm not sure what we're gonna do, haven't decided. But comment below if you like her wallpaper. Excuse Sienna in the background. I don't know what she's doing. I just hide her. So yeah, I'm quite impressed with that. I think it's turned out quite well. Right, thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and share our channel with all your friends and we'll see you again in the next video. Probably tomorrow we'll vlog the obviously last, the last remainder of a room makeover. So see you later. Sienna saying goodbye.